and indeed good morning everybody it's sunday it's a spiz day well it should be a spiz day today but unfortunately bro can't make it today he's got other plans so it's just me on my own today um i don't actually know where i'm going i don't know what i'm going to do I'm just going to grab a map have a quick look and we're just going to go for it another road trip into the unknown but folks i'm never on my own because you are there with me right folks first thing i'm going to do today the first part of the adventure because i've never been in that pet shop before i'm going to go in now i have been in there a long 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 time ago when jody was about two or three we used to go look at the chinchillas see if there's any furry animals in there today walking fast walking fast walking very fast walking fast walking fast walking very fast It's canine beer. <laughs> they have actually dog beer, folks. Wow. Nice. Full working order. You never know when you might need it. So we double box them just in the off chance that he just ate through it to the box and flush There we go, pets at home. Yeah. Open my eyes a little bit. All the wonderful things you can get for animals these days, amazing. Right then, onward with the next part of the adventure. The sun seems to be trying to come out, folks. Excellent. Now, in all the years I've been here, folks, I have never been up here before. We have a plug life. Waste ground to me. And we are in whatever this is. So, as I said, I've never been here before and I don't even know what it is. It's some sort of truck graveyard by the looks of things. So, we'll have a, a little explore of this. There's obviously trucks here and things, so it's not totally derelict as you can see but if you like trucks and machinery then this could be the place for you oh nice color <laughs> lovely turquoise yeah. so this looks like some sort of machine Nakayama. I think this one, actually I know what it does. You put the bricks in there and it comes out as gravel chips, am I right? I know. Nature cam, folks. Let's have a, the gate. Oh, some burnt out lorries coming up here, folks. Oh, there it is. Totally burnt out. Oh, here's nature taking over. It's weird, isn't it? Danger, keep out. Alright, 
right, there we go then, another place <laughs> I've never been to. And there's a big black cloud weather report, weather update, big black cloud, and it's actually really cold now. So, uh, onward we go. Now, here's a house that's fascinated me since we moved here. Just not really sure what it's all about. Looks like some sort of waterboard building, doesn't it? It's like the one's very similar at uh, the other place just down the road. So, can't get into it, unfortunately. It's all locked up. Oh, no, it's not. It's open. Oh, we're in. Oh, cranky. That was a surprise. Oh, it's all bricked up, though. It's all around the back of this building, but... Just nothing to report, really. It's well, it's actually got round the back of this building, but there's there's nothing to report, folks. Really, it's just uh, just a I don't, I don't know what it is to tell you the truth, but it has fascinated me for ages. Just every time we come past here, we see it. I think it's got something to do with the waterboard, uh, because as I said, it's a similar sort of architecture to the one that's just down beside the Swanee Ponds. So, uh, there you go. Another place I can mark off that I've, I've been today. Well, I've never been up here, folks, so here we go. This is a little hill. And you can see Cox's stack as well. Excellent. So here we are in this rather urban environment. Never been up here before. Another place, folks, that I've been that I've never been before. So awesome. I don't know what this place is called. Batley's Warehouse or Wholesale, sorry. So this is obviously the fire escape for uh, part of the building. We're going to have a quick nosy. And the customer looks quite interesting in there. So. Go and see what's in there. Oh, crikey. What is this place? Lots of adverts. Crikey. Oh, there it is. Opening hours. Oh. Well, I don't know what this place is, folks, but uh, it's uh, an echoey environment, and I don't think there's anybody here. So it's going to have to be done. Spears! Oh, good one. Yes, very good indeed. Right. Most interesting. It's like a, a railway station or something. Isn't it? Look. Weird. No sign of life. There's a... Oh, sorry there, but... Very strange indeed. All these adverts. Right. Amazing. Oh, it's there. So, yeah, nice little urban place here. I've never been here before, folks, so... It just seems to be full of warehouses and um, it's like empty buildings along there, so... Got chased away, folks. Felt a bit intimidated there. Not like Jag to get intimidated, but there's more empty buildings here. ATS Euromaster. Well, it's like an old tyre depot here or something, folks. Gertin Recycling. I'm exhausted, folks. Absolutely exhausted. And I'm very tired as well today. 